What's up guys, it's Jordan at Not A Garage again. We are back on our SR20 to, or 180SX. Canelo's bagging a STI. Uh, he's got all the STIs in the bag. So, uh, now we ended the other video. Uh, and now we are back on it, just kind of getting it buttoned up. So, wanted to show y'all basically the end and us getting it all wrapped up. So, stick with us, watch us rib nut some stuff, watch us edge seal some stuff, and get this car knocked out. downward stroke here we're putting everything back together uh, putting shit in putting the all the stuff back on how we want it to be so right now just getting things buttoned up you know, affix everything and get it nice and secured for our customer um, wrap on kbd is an absolute nightmare but we're making it happen so bear with us and see how it goes so this is going to be like a quick little wrap up of our uh 180sx project um i filmed a little bit yesterday but uh, i was tired trying to get out of here um as you can see we're pretty much done we got a few little things to tidy up right here um then we're gonna wrap some wheels while we're at it today so we're gonna get the cars out we're gonna put this up on the quick jacks kind of out in the middle there um so that me and canelo can both kind of tackle it at the same time get these wheels wrapped up get the shop cleaned up and we're gonna head out of here a little early today um uh, i purposely did not book any appointments because i'm going to Canelo's going to be off early I'm going to edit some of these videos get them up on the YouTube for y'all to see because they're not doing anybody any good here on my GoPro so yeah let's get to it all right so we're getting this car buttoned up uh as we're getting it all you know done uh the front grill uh looked like a lot of white for the kind of theme that we got going on here so I went ahead and cut these out on the plotter laid them on I think it looks really good it adds like a little little touch but don't touch it too much I'm about to start putting in the finishing washers and removing these placeholders um, on the uh, the body here and then it will be done we're gonna throw it outside wash it off real quick or just give it a good wipe down uh, I know we got to clean out the interior uh, did you put all the panels back in for the ECU? Oh, that's a bit of a Okay. Yeah, so we're getting there. We're almost there. I got to bolt the battery back down all the way. Uh, yeah, we should be done here in the next 30 minutes or so. So the customer is on the way. Let's see if we can get it done. So you can see here we got our decided to put some uh, wide body molding around the uh, the kit because the kbd fitment is a little funky uh, and then in here you can see our finishing washers so you know with the whole black and white theme you know from a little bit it looks super oem uh, with the kit and canelo's working away putting the battery back in the car's up too high for him you lower it down yeah lower the car down so got one more side to do um, then this car is good it's good to go it's all done all right so put some zip ties to hold up some cladding uh, because the old bumper is no longer there but with that that's gonna mark the end of our journey with this car um, so rundown of what all we did we did quick release on the steering wheel we did the side skirt installation. I'm gonna take this off. 
So we installed a full KBD body kit on this car. We mounted a front mount intercooler, quick release steering wheel. So you can see fuel pressure regulator, Tomei fuel pressure regulator, and the front mount kit. So we made a block off plate for where the battery used to go and now where the uh, intercooler pipe goes down and through. And then we also wrapped the body kit. You're, you make a nice hood prod, boy. Yeah. Yeah. So we're, we're need to get a little HKS one that doesn't, because right now it's like, it's too tight in there, but it is what it is. Uh, that was a piece of the under, under cladding that we trimmed because uh, the intercooler is there now. So overall, everything went pretty smoothly. We're all done. Engine bay looks pretty clean. So everything's installed, everything's tight. Um, we're about to let it down and go for a little test drive. Hold it, hold it! Got that Houston lean popping. It won't go up now, it's too low. Use that thing right behind you. Doofus. Canelo's uh, tired, you know, his brain's rotting away. Thanks for tuning in. Don't forget to like and subscribe.